Greetings from Washington, D.C. Although I cannot be with you in person today, it is important for me to express my strong support for the work you are doing within the Alliance for Development and Democracy. There are some basic principles that have guided our democracies for years. Human rights, rule of law, equality for all. At a time when we see democratic backsliding among our neighbors and international rules and norms under threat in Ukraine, standing up for these principles has become even more important. This is the vital work of each generation, and your three countries are carrying that work forward today in our hemisphere, and I thank you. Together, Costa Rica, the Dominican Republic, and Panama have outlined an ambitious and a necessary agenda. We will continue to count on your leadership, to counter corruption, to promote gender equality, to defend freedom of expression, to find solutions for irregular migration, and to bolster private sector investment. All of this is focused on one central goal, building a democratic, prosperous, and inclusive future for the people of Central America and the Caribbean. This work is important to me, to President Joe Biden, and to the American people. And that is why our administration is eager to partner with you on all of these initiatives. It is a priority for the United States to demonstrate to the world, together with you, that democracies can deliver results for all our people. Your work here today and through the Alliance is proving this point. And I look forward to our work together and deepening our cooperation to achieve these shared goals. Thank you all.